Thank you very much, Your Honour. Um, Senator Gold, if I may ask a question, please, about um, the Russian invasion of Ukraine. Um, the, what we know is that we are seeing, one, that innocent Ukrainian civilians need more support to face the brunt of a vicious world leader defying international law, and two, the unequal sympathy and treatment that Western countries, including Canada, have shown refugees from other conflict zones. Minister Fraser, Sean, uh, Sean Fraser told us that Canada is ready to welcome Ukrainians and there, quote, is no limit to the number of applications. We're seeing this disparity between 43,000 Ukrainians and about 16,000 Afghan refugees coming to our country. And we've looked at and heard unpalatable discourse explaining that this has to do essentially with systemic racism. My question, Senator Gold, how does this government justify the vastly disparate treatment and outcomes in Ukrainian and Afghan resettlement efforts? Gold. The government is not in the business of, of justifying the difference, the, and the explanation uh, uh, it would be multifold, including the different circumstances, horrible though they are in both the cases in Afghan and its surrounding area and Ukraine and surrounding countries, with regard to the ease or difficulty with which uh, uh, pro the processing of, of, uh, of uh, interested uh, refugees uh, could take place. Uh, and in that regard, the government is c continues to do its very best uh, to welcome as many uh, uh, refugees as it can from Ukraine and uh, continue to work to reach uh, higher levels of immigration from Afghanistan.